Hey everybody. All right. So I am actually going to do a fun, quick tutorial on basically lashes and liner. And I wanted to talk a little bit about it because I'm kind of obsessed with one, this liner to this mascara because, okay, I'm obsessed with waterproof products. Okay. Problem is, is when you get waterproof products, you can oftentimes get products that have awful parabens awful the, the things that they do to make it waterproof actually can be really bad for your eyes didn't know that my whole entire life was wearing waterproof products because I sweat because I like to be able to have that coverage and not have to worry about you know things dripping so if you can uh, if you feel that please put that in the comments like I get it I understand it I'm there with you okay so um, I actually going to show you Lime Life's products and this is actually a take two collection. Okay. This collection comes with your choice of a waterproof or, um, a regular one step fiber mascara today. I'm going to use the waterproof. It also can come with an eyeliner and it, it you could pick it in, um, tan, brown, or black, or you could pick a, a liquid liner. So if you do like a liquid liner, I'm going to just show you the tip on this. It's not a felt tip. It's like more like a brush. Uh, the the fine line and details that you're able to do with this uh, this brush is amazing. I'm just going to show you really quick um, just by me pressing down kind of like light on it. It's very wispy. Then uh, it gets a little darker, a little darker, a little thicker, a little thicker there. Okay. This is also smudge proof. So you can put this on and rub your eye and still not have to worry about it. The next thing I want to talk to you about. So if you pick this, you can pick between a brown and a black. Two things you can do with this, obviously a really great liner, but I've also been known to use this on my eyebrows. So going in and just doing little fine, like little hair strokes with the brown or black, you could totally do that, okay? So you're gonna get to pick between that eyeliner or you can do a enduring eyeliner and the enduring eyeliner is actually waterproof. So I'm gonna show you, it's a gel eyeliner. Fun little fact is I actually pick up uh, brush number 14 uh, which is Lime Life's brush. Do I have it out? Yes. Okay. And I actually take this and put this on my brows. So you can get a black, brown, or a tan. And I actually use the tan in my waterline as well. But I actually use this. I, I just scrape a little bit there. And then I carve out my eyebrows and use the spoolie brush to kind of distribute. But uh, this is waterproof brows right there for you. So how amazing is that? So you get to pick between uh, an enduring eyeliner in tan which i have on my waterline which is waterproof so it's not going anywhere uh brown or black i chose the black for today and i use that for my brows you can also go ahead and throw that in i actually use the different enduring eyeliner a purple one today but i would normally go in and throw that black as well so i love that by bundling it together you actually save money so if you're going to get an eyeliner and a mascara anyway you might as well go um with the take two collection okay so i actually haven't worn um waterproof mascara in a little while but i wanted to show you you how it makes your lashes it's pretty insane um I'm gonna be full disclosure here I'm gonna tell you I've actually been struggling with my eyelashes for quite some time I want to say over the summer I was wearing uh false eyelashes frequently and I was ripping out my eyelashes um, and I felt like I was wearing the false eyelashes mainly because I was struggling with my lashes here I was going through them kind of like sh a shedding phase but I've never had really long lashes I've always had thick lashes problem is is that I could never get the length on my lashes so a little while back I actually started taking collagen I started actually even using a lash and brow serum and I don't know if you guys can tell the difference between my brows even I know I have product on my brows but my brows are doing so much better and I right now I have like um foundation on my lashes because of the um applying it you know applying my makeup and, and everything but like you can, we're gonna get into my lashes here but I don't know if you can see the length on them they're so much longer but with that being said using a really great either fiber mascara or our um our making waves mascara which is totally totally waterproof I'm telling you it is like waterproof okay so I'm gonna go in I like to curl my lashes um, I am going to suggest if you wind up going with the waterproof to get our uh, makeoff spray. And that makeoff spray is a non-oil based makeoff spray. It really does help get um, the, the like lifts the product safely off of your eyes and the rest of your makeup off your face. So I'm going to highly recommend that if you do go that route to get the 
um, makeup spray. But if you use the one step fiber mascara, you should be able to take that off with like, you know, um, like a makeup wipe. But you, you're going to be obsessed. Once when you get the makeup spray, you're going to be like, oh, this is good. So I don't know if you guys can tell right away. I'm just going to get up here. Um, you can see my lashes are there. So we're going to need a little help. We're going to need some mascara. So this I definitely want to be careful with because once when I put this on, it really is difficult to get off. So I just want to be really, really careful. So we're going to go in and just start applying the mascara. And we're going to do one coat need to like I should have opened up a new one because I, I think I've actually had this since the summertime so a new one would have helped I have a new one but that's okay you guys will get the idea with one coat and how they look here so I absolutely love mascara in fact that was probably one of the things when I wasn't with Lime Life like I would splurge on a really good mascara there was an Urban, De Urban Decay one that I was just like obsessed with and this actually gives me a bit of Urban Decay vibes with what it does for my lashes. So it's going to give me that like extra little boost. Obviously, um, curling them really, really helps. But you guys can see already. Can we just look at that? Like curling them helps. Um, tinting them helps. So if that's ever something like you're going to look into, I highly recommend it. I've been known to actually tint them and lift them myself but I would actually probably prefer just to go and get them done because it is a tedious job and I don't recommend just you doing it on yourself. But, um, okay, here we go. So I'm going to show you guys just my first coat. I'm going to go in with another, another coat, um, here in a second. I like it to dry a little bit, but I will get close so you guys can see my lashes there. Can we just take a moment and say, thank you, mascara. <laughs> So I've been wearing magnetic eyelashes a lot lately, which I find that they're not harmful, uh, which has been really, really nice. But just like that, you guys see that's one coat and I can always go in and just curl them. So this Take Two collection is really great because like I said, you can use the liner for your brows if you want. Um, and then just getting a really nice mascara. Um, you're, and plus, you're saving money by purchasing them together. I have to get the price, so I'll probably include that on um, the bottom or the link so you can you can go ahead and, and grab that if you want. Um, but definitely reach out to me because that's the beauty of um, having a beauty guide like me is someone to guide you through that process. And as much as, you know, um, it's like, oh, it's fun to like shop online. Sometimes it can be a little overwhelming, right? Especially when you're trying to find products that are going to really um, be useful. And when you're investing in products that are um, higher quality, you want to make sure that you're getting the right thing, right? Like, so, you know, if I go to CVS and spend three or four dollars and I happen to not like it, I'm like, whatever, it was only three or four dollars. But, you know, if I'm spending 10, 15, 20, 30 dollars on something, I want to make sure in, in this case, you're, you're going to get two you know, two for, um, in a take two collection, you want to make sure that you're getting the right product. So I can help suggest like, maybe you're more of a, you know, a liquid eyeliner. Maybe you're like, no, no, no. Like I'd prefer a pencil, you know? So I want to kind of walk you through some of those, those, uh, those options. Okay. So I'm going to go in, I'll show you guys now. This is just one coat and I really should have opened up a new mascara, you know, when you're just at the end of it, but that's okay. It's still giving me it's still giving me lashes. And guys, I'm telling you, like, I remember the first time I tried this, I saw everyone else using it. And I was like, what the heck? Like, my lashes do not look like that. Well, it's because I was really struggling, like I said, with my lash, my lash growth. Um, and I've been really taking care of them. I guess I didn't ever realize that I'd be able to, um, that I'd actually be able to grow my lashes. I always was just like, okay, what, what you get is what you get, you know? Hello, hello, lovely lady. How's it going? So with that, I was kind of like, all right, well, that's it. I guess that's what all my lashes are going to do for me. But you guys can just see, like, there they are, nice and lengthened. So I'm going to go in with a second coat. I wish I knew where, um, I wish I would have pulled up a new, a new um, mascara. That would have really, really helped. We'll just go in and we're going to do a little second coat here. And this is just to give me a little bit more oomph. And I am going to put on, um, when I get done here, I'm going to throw on my magnetic lashes. Just look at that though. 
thank you mascara and it's waterproof guys it doesn't have all that that yucky stuff in it it's a healthier way of wearing waterproof mascara and i'm telling you it does not it doesn't budge it does not go anywhere so um i really am going to need a really great makeup spray to take this off and i'm glad i have that so that's the other thing is i highly recommend pairing it with that so i'm going to go ahead and throw a little bit on the lower lash too let me just do this one little section right here See, my problem was, was my eyelashes were also so, like I wasn't used to them being like not as thick. And so I was getting like all product on my eyelid even, like up top here where my, where I did my, um, my eyeshadow and that was really frustrating me. I was like, what the heck is going on? So I've been taking care of my eyelashes. Who knew that was like a whole thing, but I've been, um, putting in an oil treatment on them for the last couple months. I've been doing that for my brows too. I've noticed a major change and the growth of my lashes and brows. So that's really, really nice. I also have been putting, um, we actually have marula oil in one of our nighttime serums and I've been adding that on as well. So I think combination between taking collagen, taking hair, nail and um, skin vitamins and uh, and also taking the, uh, the brow serum and gel and the other serum as well. I think it's a combination of all of it. Can, can we just like look at how these lashes look? I'm so thrilled. And this mascara is everything. So if you guys are interested in something like this, we do have the um, the Take Two collection, which like I said, you're gonna get you're gonna get to pick two uh, two items and it really depends on what you need. So if you're more of a, I think I stuck my, yeah, it's right in my shirt here. I stuck my, I thought I was gonna use um, this, the One Step Fiber Mascara. You're gonna get to pick between our One Step Fiber Mascara or our, um, waterproof mascara. I've, I have the waterproof on today. So you're going to pick between one of these. Okay. This is the take two collection, or you can pick between an eyeliner, either a brown liquid eyeliner pen. And as you can see, you guys can get like really, really thin lines or a thicker line. It comes in black or brown, or you're going to pick a, an enduring eyeliner, which comes, I actually used it on my eyebrows today. You can use it here. Um, I even used the, the tan, but you can use tan black or brown. You can pick from. That's the Take Two collection. And then other than that, I'm highly recommending two other products that you're gonna wanna throw in. If you're getting the eyeliner pencil, I highly recommend our sharpener. It's only six bucks. And I'm telling you, it just gives like the perfect, with, with it has it's like meant for this. It was made for it. So I highly recommend going in and getting that. And then if you are getting the uh, waterproof mascara, I highly recommend using the Make Off Spray going in there because it does not, like you'll go, you can take a shower with this on and it will not come off when it's waterproof. You know, some products say like waterproof and you're like, okay, sure. This is legit. Like I can go swimming with it and it does not go anywhere. Do you? Yeah. And actually it's so funny. So, so Robin just said about using the, the mascara, like warming it up is the best thing. So I either put it in my shirt, I actually sit on it. Um, if I'm in my car and I need it, I'll throw the heater on and I'll put it in front of the heat. I'll even take a blow dryer sometimes to heat it up. So what's really great about heating up the one step fiber mascara is that there's little fibers in here It actually helps really break it down. Um, I notice it's like a lot smoother, like the, the formula is so much more smoother than putting it on like fresh just like sitting out so when you kind of warm it up I've even know, been known to just do like this for for a minute or so depending on how much time I have but I always because like mascara is one of the last thing that I put on I always either stick it in my shirt or sit on it um just to get it nice and heated up and I was going to do that but I actually wound up going with the um Oh my gosh, I'm so obsessed with this mascara. I went, wound up going with the uh, Making Waves. So if you're interested, um, please reach out to me. I'd be more than happy to help you out and hook you up. Like I said, you're getting a beauty guide, somebody who's going to be there every step of the way, give you all that stuff that I just talked about, help figure out like what do you need personally. So it might be like, I'm not a big fan of liquid eyeliner. And I'm like, great, let's go into the, the gels. Or maybe you are looking for you know, something that like that. Um, gosh, yes, I do have purple eyeliner, Miranda. I'm actually wearing it right now. If you look on this, uh, my lash line, I can get a little closer. That's purple eyeliner. It comes with, um, I'll actually show it to you. 
It comes with purple and also a gold. And it's my favorite one, as you can see. It comes in a, a dual eyeliner here. So this is the purple. And I'm wearing this right now on my eyes. And I'll just swatch it out. And then the gold here. They're just so stunning and they're waterproof. So there's the purple and there's the gold. I'm just obsessed. We also have, these are the, these do not come in the take two, but you can buy these separately. Another one of my favorites is actually this green. Yes, totally will message you, Miranda. Um, that's the green and that one I'm pretty much obsessed with. And then you can also get, um, on the other side is kind of like a, what's the word? Like a creamish, like cream champagne color. So these, there's so many of these too. There's um, like, the, let me just show you. Since I'm swatching, I might as well show you guys the eyeliners. There's this beautiful navy. You used to have to like buy these in a collection together. Now you can buy them separately. And I'm like, and that comes with like this really pretty like rose, rose shade. Um, You can do an AM and PM, which is basically using the black. Um, hang on, I found it black and um, tan, which is what I use today. So I have the black on my eyebrows and the tan in my waterline. Normally I would put the black too, but I'm obsessed with purple. So um, there's that. And then there's also, if you like brown eyeliner, I really love brown eyeliner. There's a brown chocolate like looking one. And then there's also this bronze, which I'll show you in a second here, which, so I love brown eyeliner, um, but you can also use the brown on your eyebrows if you have brown hair. Um, there's the, uh, the bronze is the lower one right here and just look how pretty there's like almost a metallic look to them. And that's what I really love about these eyeliners. As soon as they set too, they're not going to go in anywhere. Like that's still, they're still a little wet, but once when they set, they don't go anywhere. And that's what I love. Like I can rub my eye and my eyeliner is not going to get messed up or I can rub my eyebrow and nothing's going to come off my eyebrow. Do you know what I mean? Um, the other one is, um, okay, ready did that one. I just have a ton of eyeliners. As you guys can tell, I really, really love eyeliner. Um, and I love that this, the Take Two collection is kind of like your, uh, your like go-to, like you can pick between one eyeliner or liquid eyeliner and then like your mascara. It's like those two items are so key to have in your, in your um, when you're trying to upgrade or even try these products out. If you guys have never tried Lime Life by Alco and I'm telling you, um, these are professional products. They are meant to last they are meant for um kind of high performance in the ev for the everyday wear and that's what i'm obsessed with it so like i think of when i think high performance i think oftentimes maybe even a little like maybe not as user friendly but it is and that's what's amazing about these products is they're for the everyday wear for the everyday user um and then you get a beauty guide like me you know helping assist you and get you like the right products getting you the you know the right items that you're going to need to set your makeup bag up, your routine for success. And that's what I really, really love about it. But um, not to mention, they're meant for like, like I think of like high performance. So people who are sweating, people who are wearing masks and like don't want their makeup to be coming off. Like you take your mask off and I don't want like all of this beautiful work that I did today to be on my, my mask, right? So there's so many really great things that I could help you with when you're picking out your, your makeup, uh, like, trying to figure out what items to throw in your makeup bag even or upgrades that you would want to do. So if you have questions, please reach out to me. Please make sure you take care of yourself, take care of someone else. And I'd be more than happy to help you out um, with any of these products. Like I said, getting those those uh, two items do save you money by bundling them together. So if you have any questions about that, please reach out to me. And yeah, I'm all set. Um, last but not least, I'm probably just going to throw on a little bit of eyeliner up top. And then I also have my... Um, my magnetic lashes that I've been really big into. If you guys have not heard me talk about them, I actually don't have them in here or otherwise I would do them. I'll probably do like just a YouTube video tutorial on them. Uh, so if you want to subscribe to my channel for YouTube, just drop the word YouTube and I'll send you um, how to subscribe to it. But these uh, pro magnetic eyelashes are pretty amazing. Um, they are, are lore. I get these at Target. I don't know if there's anywhere else you can get them, but they are foaming lashes. It says you get 15 wears. I've definitely gone over the 15 wear mark. I just take care of them really nice, but they are the accent ones. So if you're into that, um, you basically put uh, like three layers of eyeliner on your top lid and then you go ahead, toss the accents on the, just the ends here. And I'm telling you, they give you that extra little oomph and they look like 
people have been saying, are those your real lashes? Because they look just so seamless and real. So big fan of that. I'm going to, I think I'm going to go record a video right now on how to apply them and talk a little bit more about them. But have a wonderful day. I think I said this, but please make sure you take care of yourself. Take care of someone else. I'll talk to you all very soon. And thanks for joining me. Bye everyone.